Hello, everyone. Today we have Adam Marsden with us. He is the SVP Client Solutions at Crux OCM. So today we want to talk a little bit about uh, his transition. He's had a, a wandering road from oil and gas, uh, you know, into tech and well, sales. Uh, so I want to learn a little bit more about that with him to especially help equip folks who in this current situation have been laid off from oil and gas. So give them a little bit of info or a little bit uh, of a story of how someone else has done it. Um, so Adam, what is it that you do for us at Crux OCM? So hi Vicki, um, I am the SVP of Client Solutions for Crux, which is a really fancy way of saying that I do all of the client uh, sales functions as well as the commercialization of the product line. Great. So um, what's your back educational background and, and how did you get started in oil and gas and what was your, your path to, to tech? So uh, actually by education, you know, by trade, I'm actually a geophysicist, which is uh, very interesting to be in a sales function now. So I started off many years ago uh, doing some field work as a geophysicist in Egypt. Uh, then after that, I did work for a technology company for many years doing everything from consultation work through to actual uh, geoscience work, uh, project-based work for them. And uh, then after that, I thought I would uh, go uh, full, full steam ahead into the geosciences. So I became an explorationist for an offshore company. And through the last uh, major downturn, um, being offshore, of course, those of us that are in the industry know it wasn't uh, the best place to be per se. So I decided at that time to go back to school, to get my MBA, full fledged and full steam ahead into uh, sales. Okay, yeah, so yeah, you definitely, what, what a lot of folks are going through right now, you went through in the last downturn. Um, and, you know, with us, as I've mentioned in other videos, like we, you know, we are stable right now and, and we're not hiring, but we're certainly not letting anyone go. So you're not feeling the effects this time around. Mm -hmm. um, so how did you end up in, you know, we kind of went through it, how you ended up in, uh, in a tech company. Um, what were, and, and we also went through your education and what, your, what you did there. So what advice would you give somebody considering to expanding their skills and, and coming into tech or commercialization like you have? I think the key thing for me when uh, a few years back is I, I said, you know, I, I still want to be in oil and gas. Um, but what other things fascinate or what other things am I really passionate about aside from geoscience? And uh, so for me, that was, of course, sales and the commercial process. For other people, it might be IT, it might be finance, uh, et cetera. So my suggestion would be, uh, you know, during this, this time, um, utilize online resources, um, maybe go to, to night school like I did when things stabilized and uh, just uh, get some additional schooling, whether it's uh, certifications, MBA, et cetera, and uh, maybe try to augment your current uh, career path with it. Yeah, so yeah, so some, some reflection time. Um, yeah, so with Adam, you know, please reach out to him directly um, or myself um, if we can help make any connections or anything. Um, yeah, I don't know, Adam, if you had any, any last words on, on how you can maybe help out some folks? Yeah, I think, I think for sure, and especially in the industry in the time right now, um, if anybody wants to reach out to me on LinkedIn, uh, connect with me, see who's in my network, and I can definitely try to do some intros to you uh, for them. And uh, yeah, definitely reach out at these times. Yeah, we're all in it together. Okay, thanks, Adam. Take care.